Your computer is running with an issue here. As you are trying to open a program you have recently installed, this error arrives. The program can start because xsign port 1 underscore 3 dot dll is missing from your computer. It's a very common issue and all you need to do is watch this video till the end without skipping. Hello everyone, welcome to Tech Evolution. In this very short video, I'll be fixing this problem within 3 minutes. So, let's begin. The first thing you need to do is open your favorite browser and search for xinput1 underscore 3.dll. You can choose any results, I'm choosing the first one. This is not sponsored, but I'll put the link in the description. If you scroll down, you can see a few download options based on the architecture of Windows. To know your architecture and version, to click on Start and Search for System Information. Here you can see my new 64 bit. As I am updated to the recent Windows update, I'll be downloading the second one. I strongly recommend you to read this page, it has multiple fixing method also, you can follow that too, but we are following the easiest way, as the download complete, hit open. The downloaded GIF has two files, one is the DLL, other one is readme. To move the DLL, open this PC, new volume C, Windows, Open this and find a folder name system32. There it is. Now click on the downloaded GIF, drag the DLL and drop. I have already done this so they are asking me to replace. And click on continue. Before we proceed, let's check by typing the file name. You can see the file is properly placed in this folder. 32 bit process is done. If you are a 64 bit user, you need to do a little more. Open this PC one more time. Local DC, Windows, and this time find a folder name syswow64. And same again. Drag and drop. Check this file one more time. Yes, the file is properly placed. And finally, restart your computer. In extremely rare cases, if the error tree occurs, you need to download Microsoft DirectX from Microsoft Shell website and install your program again. And that's all. If you follow me step by steps, you will no longer have that problem left. Please let me know how you feel about this video. And do not forget to like and subscribe.